Goodness me, um, I can't even use the words that I want to um, use to describe um, those two people, the people that are supposed to, you're supposed to protect your children. And I have to say, this that story has made me very upset. Um, and how many times, how many times do we hear um, these cases of child cruelty and abuse um, and then we find out that things had been reported to the social services and to the police? How many children... Um, need to die before these services are, are fully looked at to make sure that they are operating uh, efficiently and effectively as well, I wonder. And I guess the only point I would like to make as well is, you know, Arthur is not the only child that gets abused. There will be many children now, even now, that are getting abused. And I would call, I would call for anyone, I would beg anyone, if you have a child um, and you are abusing them, and there will be people that are doing this to their children, please don't do that. If you can't bring yourself to love your children and to protect your children, then give someone else the opportunity to love that child. Because I promise you, um, there are so many people I would um, adopt a child that was in harm in an instant. And there are so many, so many um, like me. Um, but I would just say, Arthur, you beautiful little boy, I hope that you rest in peace. I do. Um, right, I'm, I do apologise. I'm a mum as well to a little boy myself and I found that story very distressing.